Delaware first and ten at their own 25. And the Blue Hens start on the ground. Kyrie Cumby cutting back. The best conference top to bottom in FCS. He's back to the one man up in Chandler Harvin. From Houston, who came over with Ryan Cardi, first year head coach. A little screen on first down. Marcus Yards. Delaware with first down and ten after the penalty. And they go back on the ground. Kyrie Cumby hopping through and strung out well by Bell Caliber defense line. Anderson flushed down the pocket by Brown. He's got some space to run inside the five. Dinkle, the punter, taking the snap. They're going to go for two. Anthony Paoletti, the Wildcat quarterback, has nowhere to go. 15 total touchdowns for Doyle in his last three. And he starts with a handoff to Quayshon Holmes. Third and seven. Doyle fires into traffic. And was that... Slaby gets the punt off, and Townsend says stay away from it. It takes a same. Hand off to Marcus Yarns. Good room to run past the 20. Second and three. Give to Yarns again, cutting outside, and enough. For they got to adjust faster than they are right now. Anderson back to throw, completes over the middle. Anderson is short pitch. Yarns. Good tackle on the perimeter. Anderson escapes the pocket and completes past the sticks again. To run, right? And that's what Henderson does such a good job of is looking to, to create that big play as he's scrambling. Yarn. And completing the Thyric pitch. His favorite target. Eight first downs already for the Delaware offense. Henderson off play action. Sets up. Fires open. Harvin. Touchdown. Right out of the shotgun. And a late sub running on for St. Francis. Throw into the back of the end zone. And it's good. He's done. Leading the red flash. First down run play. LaBelle Armstead. His first carry up. In the gun for second and two. Hunter Brown the motion man. And he fires underneath. And they go on the ground. Armstead got smacked. Doyle completes this time to Surratt, and the ball came free. And now they're going to rule it incomplete. Dangerous return man. They bring the heat, and they got to it. Blocked away. Justice Henley with a block. In a hurry. Henderson. Crossing route complete, Michael Jackson twisted down and they fumble. St. Francis looking to pick up third and eight. Swing pass to Holmes who makes the catch on the run. Second down. Doyle off his back foot and this time. St. Francis putting together its first drive. Doyle off play action, zings it down the sideline. Caught Dawson Snyder over the shoulder. His favorite target is Dawson Snyder. Swing pass on the perimeter for Jackson. Gonna run or throw it. It's Doyle to the end zone. Touchdown. Ready to kick it. Kick is up and it is good. So the rest of Sebastian Benjamin's up in the line of scrimmage right now. Move the pocket for Henderson, who completes underneath. Michael Jackson with its team on another FCS postseason run. Cumby with the carry and a lot of space into the second level. Tyron Cumby. First round playoff game up 14 to 3 on St. Francis. Henderson running around from some pressure. O'Hara trying to chase him down. He just has a little Johnny Manziel. He does. In him. And number two in that escapability. Cumby forward. Balls out again. They forced two turnovers. And their offense starts from their own 44. Quayshon Holmes running strong. He's the first five weeks of the season trying to learn the system coming over from Juco. Another give to him. And he takes some contact. Maybe looking to get this one off cleanly. And he does. Jordan Townsend waves for fair catch. And he makes it just inside the 20-yard team. Maybe we can go call a field hockey game sometime, Sam. What do you think? I, I've never done one before, so we'd have to lean on Julia sure for some good tips. It. <laughs> <laughs> it's only allowing 165 yards passing a game. Third and long, Henderson, and they finally get to him.
Ben Dinkle on to punt. And he gets it away. Ali lets it bounce. And it rolls inside the 30-yard line. The defense just made a big stop, forcing Delaware three and out. A handoff on the ground. 11 minutes to play in the half. Doyle off play action. Throws it up in the air. Snyder, Ocean Man. And a blitz by Delaware. Doyle throws on the run again. Complete to Hunter. Brown. Gain of seven for Brown. So now a punt on fourth down and two. Jordan Townsend calls for fair catch. And he's a game. Run play. Marcus Yarns. Cuts it upfield. Into the second level. And now he's loose. Yarns down the sideline. One man to beat. The touchdown on their first red zone trip. And off Corey Spruill, running with some steam from the St. Francis 20. Henderson, with pressure in his face, gets the screen off to Townsend. And he's cut down. Levin. Henderson keeps up the middle, and he dives forward. It'll... Henderson, look at end zone. Pitch! Jumping! And Ratcliffe on for the extra point. 5.29 to go in the half. A handoff, and Quayson Holmes has plenty of room. First on offense. He's still in the backfield, and he gets the call coming to the near sideline. Because they mix up personnel so well. Some concern for Doyle getting checked on by the trainer on the bench. Townsend makes the first and 10. Blue Hens own 36. And Henderson connects with Pitts. Busts off a tackler. Pass midfield. He thinks he's going over the top. He puts the brakes on and comes back to the quarterback. Henderson over the middle. Complete to Brett Buckman. Henderson is up there with the likes of the best ones in Delaware history. Front play on third down. Cumby with a hole. Spinning inside the 10. Field for the majority of this first half. They dig in. Henderson spins off play action. And so was that. Kick up from Ratcliffe. Team. And right now they're in a 25 point hole. And that and Armstead. No way. In all, almost all the games this season, 10 of them. His first pass complete on the far side. Elijah Surratt. Six foot two. Noah Platt. Just another punt block. But Slavey able to get it off. And Jordan Paul, so be good at what you're best at. Second and seven, Henderson through the air, and Harvin's running free again! Chandler Harvin! Eight is Wheaties for sure, A.B. Extra point. Getting ready to return anytime soon. Seven of 20 for just 82 yards. Delaware almost got... Owen Henderson back to work. And on the ground, Kyron Cumby. First down yardage into St. Francis territory. Well, really, Ryan Carty is the head coach, but he is the play caller for Delaware. And Scott Lewis for St. Francis. Cumby, big yard for the 93 yards on the ground for Cumby. He gets the call again. Kyron Cumby inside the 15, inside the 10, and all the way. Henderson looking for the fade. Intercepted. Intercepted by St. Francis. Kerry Galloway running on the far sideline. And Gallagher is trailing by 32. And they get it. Complete over the middle. Makai Jackson. Be all right. Seeing in some pain on the bench. Slowski on play action. There's the other freshman, Eliza Surratt. Leading the Blue Hens to a 35-3 lead. Run play. Armstead. Taking 5-20 to play in the third. And a handoff. Damon Holton. Did he get there? Under center. And a play fake. Under backside pressure and going down. Amante. Just the fifth offensive touchdown against the Blue Hens at home this year. As Alex Smoke tacks on the F. Flacco. We'll have a little more on that later on. Back to the ground game. Marcus Yarns gets the call. As much as I love throwing the football, our offense is so much better when we're running it well. And, you know, he, he said, hopefully we don't see Screen pass on first down. Complete to James Collins making a man miss. And Collins during the selection show, they were talking about plans for the offseason, what they were going to do from a facility area who grew up dreaming of playing at Delaware, just like Nolan Henderson did. 
He throws on fourth and three and connect. More time before the end of the third. And they'll run it with Watson up the middle. Ninth play of the drive for the Blue Hens. And a run near the goal line. The extra point. And his kick is up and good. Beautiful facility that holds just under 19,000. Back to the ground game for St. Francis. Are that able to get the job done here today as Slawaski's under pressure. And Slawaski's going down. On every spot, they have talent and guys that can run. Justin Slaby's punt. Caught by Jordan Townsend. Another good day at the office. New quarterback in for Delaware, Zach Wynn, number 12, the backup. He's got Corey Sproul in the backfield with him. And he'll keep with plenty of space. Zach Wynn in the red zone. 400, they're averaging 400 some yards of offense a game and only 27 points a game. That's because they're so bad when they get inside the 20s. Ali fields a punt. Got a chance to make a return. Twisted forward to the 30. Remember, no Cole Doyle. He got hurt at the end of the first half. The quarterback for St. Francis. Oh, no, no. To recruit to. And they've got some great talent. Now the, one of the biggest challenges of the offseason is going to be keeping all these talented freshmen they have. I mean, you got only the only veteran of the group was Willie O'Hara, fifth-year senior they had transferring at linebacker. Most of these guys are under time in, in the NFL, was, was known as a technician for being super diligent and tough and everything he did. But for him and his family, he's got to it's back on the way on offense. Ryan, and he's like, that sounds like my stats. And then Coach Blair will surprise the team and told him, Defensive coordinator to player of the year, the first in St. Francis program history. Quincy Watson with the run, pass midfield to the 48. The third stringer played in the Morgan State game earlier this year through a touchdown pass. And Watson funneled up in football week in and week out. And as we talked to Coach Valerio at St. Francis, he said that was a concern. Can they keep up with, the, with a team that sees what? And now first and goal. For the Blue Heads as they run it with Corey Spruill spinning to the goal line for a touchdown. As Delaware continues to cruise. Kick is up. Steer has his team. Set for a playoff victory. Lavelle Armstead changing direction. Already back inside his own 10 going the wrong way. And he lost the ball. It's loose for the Blue Heads. Still loose in the end zone. And still loose. Do they get on it before the end line? Touchdown! It's good. And the chance to make a run in this thing. What a, what a difference a week can make. I mean, this time last... Last weekend on the road in Philly. Lost on the last play practically a fourth and goal as Jackson runs hard. He's got a first down. Take a job for the first time. Inherit these rosters that have lost a bunch of players that have recruited poorly. Side of the emotions. In the postseason, Slawoski on the run. Nice completion to Elijah Soul. Schools that are under recruited and then developing them. And, and you got to have a great culture to have guys play really well. Slawoski. And whistles before the extra point. Penalty marker down. Nice snap and the give to Corey Spruill. Balling a little lead blocking. It's a advantage, but we're not like turbo speed where we're going three and out in 10 seconds, like like sometimes those Oregon teams used to do under Chip Kelly. But in the FCS first round over St. Francis, 56 to 17, the final.